today we're going to be playing one of my favorite games, and it is Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, we're going to be playing on the Xbox 360. See my old keypad on my Xbox controller. Um, so yeah, this is one of my favorite games, uh, aside from Fallout 3 and Skyrim. Uh, my other favorite Assassin's Creed game is uh, Black Flag. Uh, such an amazing game, and 2 is just one of my all-time favorites. Uh, so yeah, very excited to play this game, and without further ado, let's get right into it. As you can see, uh, last time I played this game was in 2015. Uh, just wanted to come back and revisit this game, and, you know, just see what I could do. Um, and this is, like, one of my first saves. It says 2005, but this game hasn't even come out in 2005. It came out in 2009. Uh... So this is incorrect. I think the last, the first time that I played it was like in it's white balance. It's not good. Uh, first time I played this game was like a uh, 2011, 12 maybe. Um. So yeah, I absolutely love this game since I played it. So we'll go ahead and do a new session. My name is probably gonna be just uh. Probably just Ezio. Actually, I have a, I have a keypad. I keep forgetting that. I'll just jump into it. My name is Desmond Miles. I'm a prisoner of war. A war I never knew existed. Waged by two groups I never thought were real. Templars and assassins. The Animus showed me the truth. The things I've seen. The things I've been. Thousand years of history flowing through my veins, brought to life by this machine. They're using it, using me to search for something. Call it the apple. It's an artifact, one of many so called pieces of Eden. The Templars collect them. It's how they stay in power. And if the Templars get their hands on another one, everything will change. They want to make us all their slaves. When they first brought me here, I was afraid of what would happen if I tried to fight back. Now? Now I'm afraid of what will happen if I don't. But I can't do it alone. And maybe I don't have to. I met someone. Her name is Lucy. I think she's on my side. And she's gone now. She was taken away by that bastard Warren Vidic and his Templar masters. I don't know what will happen to her. Happen to me. All I know is I need to get out of here, and I need to do it soon. My name is Desmond Miles, and this is my story. It's been a very long time since I've played this game, so... I'm not like, uh... I know it, a bunch of stuff about this game. It's been a very long time, so I'll try to see if I can like can give some facts uh, during the gameplay. Press any button. We have to go. Lucy, where have you been? Why did they now? All right. Get in. What's with the blood? Are you okay? Look, we have maybe ten minutes, maybe, before they figure out what I've done. If we're not out of here and on the road before then... Wait, we're leaving? Desmond, I promise I'll answer all of your questions. Later. But right now, I need you to just shut up and do what I say. So please, get in the Animus. All right. Subject 17, Desmond Miles.
Okay. So, um, I thought I had set it to like Italian because oh, that's what I originally it's had it as. I was at the bank when they told me. Did I miss it's it? It's in English. Give him here. Giovanni. Shh, my love. It will be all right. Tu sei un auditore. Sei un combattente. Perciò, combatti. Listen to him. A fine set of lungs. And what shall we call him, my love? Ezio. Ezio Auditore da Firenze. So excited to play this game. I love this game so much. Get up. Let's go. Yeah, well, I'm gonna need a second. There isn't time, Desmond. We have to leave. I apologize for not saying much. I'm just trying to let, like, the story come out. Or not come out, but, like, just, like, let the story play. Um, so everybody can get an idea of it. I'm sure everybody by now has, really been, here, has huh? like, has an idea, like, what goes on. Because they need to play this game. Sergo's got some fucked up interior decorators. <laughs> Stay close. Or just know about it. Hey! You're not supposed to be up here! Open this door! I'm calling it in. We have a breach in the research wing. I repeat. Okay. I was trying to figure out how to run. This way. Nice walls. Fancy. It's been a while, so I played this. Maybe. I don't know. There they are! Is. Don't let them get away! <laughs> Holy shit! I rigged them to loop old footage. How do you think I managed to hide all your nighttime snooping from Abstergo? You're good. So I've been told. But they're on to us now. We need to hurry. Run. I can't run. Careful. We need to get to that elevator on the other side of the room. Follow my lead, but keep an eye out for security. I'd rather avoid a fight. Is that an Adams? Careful. Oops, I didn't mean to run out like that. <laughs> I don't know if any of y'all just heard and that, but there was like a popping sound. What do you think, Lucy? And just kind of like muted Lucy, up the game. What do they need with all of them? Um. So yeah, uh, apologize for that. The reason why it does that is because I don't have like this amazing uh, this graphics, ca not graphics card, not graphics card, capture card. Wait. And so sometimes it'll pop like that. Subject 16? Ezio Audi... Audi something? I think hmm. we've been wrong. It's your auditory. That's why we need to get out of here. Vidic and the Templars, they're only part of the problem. What do you mean? I'll explain when we get there. Get where? One day I want to visit Italy, because it just seems very pretty. I don't know how to dodge. I think it's why. There we go. Did it. 
Yeah, I am not gonna be good at combat for right now because I just have no idea what the controls are. Get in. You're joking. It's for your own protection. Oh man. We're almost there. You're probably wondering why I'm playing two instead of one and then two. Uh, it's because I absolutely hate uh, Assassin's Creed one. Uh, it's just very, very unpolished. It's kind of like Oblivion, just very unpolished. And it's Thanks some people that. like it, some people Great. don't. Shove them the trunk, bouncing around. Love this it. way. So, gonna tell me what's going on now? There was a reason for the escape, Desmond. Figures. We need your help. For what? Another treasure hunt through time? Abstergo's gonna replace their Apple of Eden. The map your ancestor found guarantees it. The other assassins, they'll do what they can, where they can, but... What? What is it? We're losing this fort. The Templars oh, are too powerful. And every day, more of us die. I still don't see how I fit into things. We're going to train you. Turn you into one of us. What? No. No, you've seen me in action. I'm no good at this, and even if I was, it would take months. Years, even. No. Not with the Animus. Not with the bleeding effect. But I'm just one guy. Sometimes, that's all you need. So that's why you found him. My ancestor. What was his name? Ezio? If you can follow in his footsteps, you'll learn everything he did, just like he did. Years of training, absorbed in a matter of days. Stop right in front of you me. You broke me out of Abstergo and brought me here just to make me an assassin? Look, there's more to it than that, but it'll have to wait. Trust me, okay? All right, I'm in. Tell me what you need. Really? You're sure? I thought you'd be happy about this. Sorry, I'm just a little surprised. I spent the whole ride over here figuring out how I was going to convince you to do this. Save it. After what those Templar bastards put me through, I'm ready, willing, and able. Thank you. Okay. Who else didn't like the Assassin's Creed movie? Lucy! I did not like it. it. God, it's been so long. Seven years, can you believe it? Indeed. Welcome back. Ah, so this must be the infamous Subject 17. Desmond Miles, was it? Who are you? I'm sorry, where are my manners? I'm Sean Hastings. This is Rebecca Crane. Nice to meet you, Desmond. Right, well, it's been lovely chatting, but if you don't mind, Desmond, it's best we get straight to work. Time is precious. Doubly so these days. We've got everything set up and ready, Lucy. Just say the word and we'll get going. Here, I brought you something. A parting gift from Abstergo. Whoa! The memory core! This is amazing! With their data, things are gonna go a lot faster. I'll get to work on merging the code. Alright, so I guess we can just... We're gonna talk to her first. Hey Desmond, what's up? Just wondering what your role is in all this. I take care of baby my job to keep her up and running. Baby? You mean the Animus? Actually, I prefer Animus 2.0, since Baby's twice as awesome as anything you'll find at Abstergo. The Templars might have deeper pockets than us, but they've got no ambition, no passion, no competitive edge. That's why, even with all their resources, anything they can do, I can do better. Faster, too. Anyway, take a seat when you're ready, and we can get started. I just need to make a few more adjustments. Okay. Um. I guess we can get in. Uh, before, I have to speak uh, to everybody. So yeah, like I said, apologies for not saying hey, much. I'm just trying to let the to say thank you. story play I'm through. I'm sorry. Sorry? Yeah, you know, before. Everything at Abstergo. It was just... I wasn't ready. It's okay. No. Going through all that. Knowing that the Templars still exist. What they're planning. What's done is done, Desmond. You're here now, and that's what matters.
What's all this stuff for? This stuff, Desmond. Oh, this stuff is nothing special, really, this stuff. It's just the stuff that keeps our entire operation from falling apart, really. It requires a great deal of concentration to keep it all moving, so you'll forgive me if I don't have time to play meet and greet. Sean's in charge of maintaining our knowledge archives. It's like a digital library. He'll be riding shotgun with me while you're in the Animus. So if you come across anything of note, people, places, <coughs> events, etc., he'll create database entries you can consult for additional information. Yeah, it's not just databases, though. I also provide tactical support for the other assassins. You know, Desmond, the ones who are out there, actually doing stuff, risking their lives, little things like that. Yeah, I don't really like him a lot. He's such a D-head. Alright, so I think now we can go into the animus. So how does this work? Of course. Deep breath. Ah! Oh, what are you, a tiny child? Sean! Well... Here we go. I don't know how long this episode is going to be. I'm, I'm going to try to get it, uh, get some stuff done in this episode. So that's just not like me sitting here not saying anything and then we're barely doing anything. Insieme per la vittoria! Insieme! Insieme! Insieme. Silenzio, my friends! Silenzio! Grazie! Do you know what brings us here tonight? Honor! Viere de Pazzi slanders my family's name and forces his own miseries upon us. If we... Enough of your nonsense, Grullo! Buonasera, Viere! We were just talking about you. I'm surprised to see you here. I thought the Patsy hired others to do their dirty work. It's your family that cries for guards when there's trouble. Cotardo. Afraid to handle things yourself. Your sister seemed quite satisfied with the handling I gave her earlier. Uccidetelo! <laughs> All right, here we go. Going into a fight. All right, hold on. Oh, where are you punching? Kick him always down. Oh, oh, I'm kicking him in the nuts. Dang, did I just kill him? There's no way he's alive after that. I just broke his neck. That is awful. Behind you. Federico, what are you doing here? I wanted to see if baby brother had finally learned how to fight. Oh. And? <laughs> you have style. But endurance is what counts. Let's see how many of them you can ruin before they get the best of you. 
Oh, dang. I just got pushed over. Let the doctor decide. It's not necessary. Besides, I've no money for this doctor of yours. <laughs> wasted it on women and wine, huh? I'd hardly call it wasted. Give me some floorings then. Or have you done the same? <laughs> <laughs> Search them. <laughs> There's bound to be something in their pockets. Okay, these guys are dead right here, I'm pretty sure. That should be enough. Hey, Let's get out of all here kinds the of money. No, I want to leave more. Okay. Hard at work. Hurry, Ezio. The sooner we're done with the doctor, the sooner we can sleep. Gosh, I am not good at doing this. Okay. Like, I'm holding it straight and he just won't go straight. Come, come, don't be shy. Ben trovato, doctor. Hmm. Fratelli Auditore, why am I not surprised? You've made quite a mess of yourself, young man. It's nothing, really. You must help him. That pretty face is his only asset. Fuck the tea. <laughs> there we are. Now get out of here. Grazie. This way. Quite a night. Indeed. I only wish they were all as much fun. Oh, wait. They are. <laughs> <laughs> we should head home, Ezio. Father's sure to be wondering where we've gone. Yes. I'd rather avoid a lecture. Up for a little race, then? To where? Uh, roof of that church. All right. On the count of three. Be time for a race. Uno, due, and then. <coughs> the title screen. Baby brother still has much to Oh learn. my gosh, please. I just want to be Come able on, to do Tantaruga. this right. I'm gonna beat him. Yeah. Get up! Come on then. This way. Where are you going? You'll see. Oh, the classic it is a good intro. Life for me, <sighs> the best may never change. And may it never change us. Oh my gosh, it still gives me goosebumps. Alright, enough of that. 
We really should head home. Let's go. Wait. What? Ezio, let Christina sleep. There will be time enough for that later. Ah. Uh. Played this game. Better hide. This was like, Keep looking. like the graphics look so good. Okay. All right. Well, I think that'll do it uh, for this episode, and then. Next episode, I'm sure it'll be more action packed. Um, yeah, that, that's pretty much it. And uh, hope to see y'all in the next video.